Hello everybody and welcome to Toddler Storytime. My name is Pearl and I'm joining you from the Central Children's Library today and I've brought with me a fairly new book that I'm really excited to share and talk about with you. But before we get started with reading today, we are going to go ahead and sing our hello song. If you've joined me for Toddler Storytime before, you're probably familiar with this one. This one is called Hi, Hello, and How Are You? And when we sing this song, we take our hands and we wave them back and forth, just like we're waving hello to a friend. Can you show me how you wave hello? Nice job, that's right. We're gonna wave our hands back and forth to the beat and we'll sing. Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you today? Very nice, everybody. And you probably noticed that when we sang this song, we asked a question. We asked, how are you today? How are you feeling? Should we take a moment and think about how we're feeling? If your grown-ups there with you, maybe you can let them know. When I try to figure out how I'm feeling, sometimes it helps me close my eyes and take a deep breath in. and blow it out and notice the way that my body feels. Right now, my body feels tired and I think I might be ready for a snack. How do you feel? How does your body feel? Again, if you're grown-ups next to you, maybe you wanna let them know. Grown-ups, if you're with me, maybe you can let your little one know how you're feeling too. Nice work, everybody. And we're gonna wrap up our hello song by clapping our hands. And we'll sing. Hi, hello, and clap your hands. Clap your hands, clap your hands. Hi, hello, and clap your hands. Clap your hands today. Wonderful work, everybody. And grown-ups, a lot of what we do in story time is putting language to experiences for little ones. We're going to talk about that a bit in our book and our rhyme today, but we also just did it with our hello song. Uh, we took a phrase that gets thrown around a lot, that people hear a lot, how are you? And we're giving that significance with our little ones by asking them to connect it to their own life and their own experiences. So we are going to practice that with this book today. It's called I See You Smile, and it was written by Deborah Farmer Chris and illustrated by Jane Massey. So we're going to watch this little one and see what they're up to. Let's take a look. Morning, sun. Wake up, hug. I see you smile. They are smiling, aren't they? They look really excited to start this sunny day. Tie-dye pants, silly dance. I like your style. That's right, that little one is getting dressed. I bet you got dressed this morning. I wonder if you're wearing tie-dye pants or maybe some other kind of pants or some other kind of clothes altogether. Ooh, bright balloon, bouncy tune. I see you wiggle. Can you give a little wiggle? Sometimes it feels nice to wiggle. It looks like this little one is bouncing to a song on the saxophone. That's a really fun instrument. Yoo-hoo, where are you? Oh. I hear you giggle. This little one's playing peekaboo under their blanket. That is so silly. Up and down, round and round. I see you twirl. And now they're wearing their blanket like a cape, huh? That's pretty cool. Gusting breeze, swirling leaves. I watch you whirl. We're about to start seeing some swirling, whirling leaves soon. I think if we watch closely, we'll see them fall off the trees. Ding dong. Look who's here. I see you clap. 
just like how we clapped in our hello song. It looks like this little one is welcoming a friend who brought a bear with them. Oh, big yawn. Oh, so sleepy. Friends are gone. It's time to nap. And this little one's rubbing their sleepy eyes. Snuggle up. Story time. I see you grin. Now, this little one has a book on their head. Is that where you put books? No, that's so silly. They're hard to read when they're on your head, aren't they? What a goofy little kiddo. Oh, cozy bed. Sleepy head. I tuck you in. I love to see you smile and twirl, giggle, clap, and yawn. You are so loved and lovable all day long. The end. Wonderful reading, friends. That was so fabulous. I think this is a really sweet, beautiful rhyming book. And grownups, like I mentioned before we read, you'll notice that as the little one goes through their day, the grownup is kind of just narrating for them, saying, oh, I see, I see you going up and down and round and round. I see you whirl. I see you clap. All of these things that their little one is doing that maybe they aren't putting words to yet, their grown-up is helping them. And when you talk to your little one about what they're doing and seeing and experiencing as they explore new experiences and feelings, that's going to help them connect that language to those experiences and also make it make a little bit more sense. So I think this book is a really great example of that. Perhaps it's something that you can try as you go throughout your day. For example, if you visit the park today, you could say, I see you laughing on the swings. That must feel so fun, right? Naming some of the things that our little one is experiencing. And in the spirit of putting language to experiences, I've got a little rhyme for you today. You might know this one already. It's quite popular. It's called, This is Big. And we're gonna use our hands to show what all of these different words mean. So I'll do it once so you get the idea, and then we can do it again together. And it goes like this. This is big, big, big. This is small, small, small. This is short, short, short. This is tall, tall, tall. This is fast, fast, fast. This is slow, slow, slow. This is yes, yes, yes. This is no, no, no. Very good, everybody. And you'll notice we didn't just use descriptive words like big and small, but we also showed some important language like yes and no, right? There's so many ways that we can help our little ones understand and make sense of maybe the expressions that people are showing on their faces, things like this. So let's go ahead and try that rhyme one more time. And we'll say, this is big, big, big. This is small, small small. This is short, short, short. This is tall, tall, tall. This is fast, fast, fast. This is slow, slow, slow. This is yes, yes, yes. This is no, no, no. Very nice, everybody. Well, thank you so much for joining me for story time today. I hope we all got to learn a little something together and enjoy a sweet story. And now it's time for us to say goodbye. So for this one, just like our hello song, we're gonna take our hand and wave it back and forth, just like we're waving goodbye to a friend. And we're gonna sing a song called, Goodbye My Friends Goodbye. And it goes like this. Goodbye my friends, goodbye. Goodbye my friends, goodbye. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye. Thank you so much for joining me again, friends. I hope the rest of your day is filled with books and learning and so much fun. And we'll see you right here again next time. Bye-bye.